Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers. If Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers, how many pickled peppers did Peter Piper pick? If Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers. <laughs> Good evening. <laughs> how are we doing? Happy Friday. Heather here. <laughs> um, I was sitting here getting ready to pack up Cody and I thought I'd come on here real quick explain what's in the box and what it's all about for all you who don't know this is Cody Cody is a rustic Kodiak um, standard size he's got a one inch uh, reinforced spine elastic it's traveler's notebook with elastic bands um, black teal and what I've chosen to do, because this is one that I rarely ever pulled and used because of the size, I decided to turn him into a traveler's notebook, right? So I ship him out into the world, a couple people at a time get him, and then he comes home so I can make sure everything's good, the box isn't too heavy and whatever, and restock. Also, in the box, there's stuff. I will tell you about it in a little bit. You can add anything you want to that box, okay? Whatever you're not using or whatever. In case I forget to say that. Um, a lot of people have added to the box, so that's why there's extra things that I'm showing you. Originally, it started with just Cody. Just Cody going out with some inserts, um, some ephemera, whatever. And then I've added a couple. Some other people have added some stuff, and it's just oh, boggling me. It's so such a beautiful thing. So inside Cody, there's pockets with some stuff in it that can be used. I created this notebook here. In this notebook, I actually cut it down from another size. This is my page, okay? So you can kind of get an idea of how to use it. This is the way I like to use it. In here, there are the rules, in case you forget. I made a homemade pocket. These are stickers that I've stuck down and journaled on. I won't show you anybody else's work. Because that's just not for me to do. And I, I don't technically have permission, even though I know they wouldn't mind if I shared it. There are hand-painted stuff in here. There is, uh, like, postcards and stuff like that. Here's my second page before sending him out. Um, you don't have to journal if that's not you. Please do if you want. The only rule is you have to write your name in the book, your first name, um, where you're from, like the state or even the town and state, whatever, and the date. So we all know where he's been. So that's just a dotted notebook. There is also somebody else who was kind enough to add a weekly planner. I don't know who added it, but thank you. That's awesome. I took an idea as to um, fill out a basic week for me so you can I get an idea of how I live my life and plan it. Okay, there is also a meal type with exercise and water intake. Feel free to use it. I created a page in there as well. So you can kind of get an idea of what I do for exercise, what I eat, how much water I take, you know. That with coffee would be like four times those dots. <laughs> There's a folder in here. You can decorate on the folder, put stuff in the folder. There's stuff in there that you can take out and use. Um, I have a plastic sleeve with a zippy. There's stuff inside with um, washi tape on the outside that you can peel and use. Uh, some ephemera. There's business cards from a previous um, stepmommy. Um, she has a business. I'm, I'm, I love it. I love it. Please add whatever you want to add to it. I don't care if it's business cards or whatever. You can put a business card from your local diner or whatever. All good. Anything you want to put in here, you can. I created a little book. One of the other ladies, her artwork is in here so you can use those. They're on stickers. Absolutely gorgeous. This is a little um, junk journal. 
that I created and threw in here because that's some type some people's medium. I created a little tiny page in here. It's pretty cool. You can use this if you want. You don't have to. You can use any of these that I'm showing you for anything you want. Um, feel free. Do one, do all. All good. This is Miss Jennifer. She is a very loved and scarred up Chic Sparrow Mr. Darcy. There is a Field Notes notebook in there. You can say take it to class, take notes in it so we all see what you're learning. That's cool. Write a journaling page, draw in it, whatever. This is a B6 root beer from JT King Leathers. She's one of the step mommies in here. Um, her business card is here in case you want to check her out. I keep looking over here. You're not there. You're over there. This was something somebody else put in here. I just used it as like a little cover. This is a little Tomoe River notebook. I have created a small little page. You all can tell what my idea is of what I like to do for journaling. It is completely up to you what you use it for, but you have to put it back in here. These three, Arby, which is the root beer from Justine King, Jennifer from Mr. Uh, um, Jennifer is a Mr. Darcy from Chic Sparrow, and this is a Speckle Thorns Rustic Kodiak. You cannot keep, okay? They have to stay in the box. You can take them out and use them while you have them, but they have to go back in the box. Okay. This is a standard size traveler's notebook. There are no pockets. This is just extra bits that you can use as well for anything you want in here. This is what the inside, it's so stinking soft. Oh my God. I wish this was gifted to me, but it wasn't. It was in the Cody's box. Um, it is the most unique, I keep saying um, and I'm sorry because I'm just so excited. Most unique looking leather I have ever seen. It almost appears like it's been um, decoupaged on top of it. It's really cool. And it's so flippity floppity. Ooh, I love it. So that is in there. You can use it for your own personal use. Or I'm not sure if you can keep it. She didn't say. But I'm sure if you wanted to keep it, all would be fine. So he's in there. Unfortunately, no name to him. There's no brand. So I don't know where it's from. I do know who put this in the box. And I, I thank you for that. Because this is a really neat little add-on. For somebody to enjoy and also the same person added a ringed planner okay this is in there she didn't say but I'm sure you can keep it if you if you love it you know we're not being totally against keeping things um, but this is something she wasn't using and she thought other people would get maybe joy out of or get to use it and try out rings if you've never used rings or just wanted to see. I don't know the brand. It is not marked. And she didn't know the brand either. In the back, there's a secretarial pocket as well as like one of those uh, notepad pockets. On the front is another secretarial pocket with um, card slots. I put these in here. I'm not ever going to use these. They're a little too big for this notebook. They are personal or personal wide. I can't remember. There is a sleeve in there in between each of the tab dividers. There is no paper that was in here when it came to me. I just added these to separate the colors. You can use it, write in it. Put some inserts in it. Whatever. That's not totally up to you. And then in the bottom of the box, you'll have things like this. Okay. This is stuff I put in there. Stuff other stepmommies have put in there for you to use. Um, you can keep whatever's in here for your own personal use. You can use it to create in. I don't care. It's stuff that past people have gotten 
and put in there that they just didn't use, which is why I said, if there's stuff you want to throw in there, by all means, please. If you don't want people keeping it, you need to put a note inside of whatever it is. Um, if it's a notebook right on the front page, this is for use with Cody. Please do not keep him, whatever. Because we don't want you having something in there that you're thinking is going to be have multiple people experience it and then have somebody to keep it. Um, there are stickers, there's washi tape, there's paper, there's all kinds of ephemera. And these, seriously, use it up, okay? Because it gets heavy. You can honestly use it for your personal use, whatever you want. You can give it to your... If there are stickers in there your kids want, by all means. If you have friends that you think would enjoy this as well, bring them over to your house. Let them check it out and let them make a page. You know, I'm not about above anybody enjoying this. Um, <clears throat> now, if you want to be a part of it, go to my Facebook group and um, message me your address. That's all you got to do. There's like roughly 10 people right now that are waiting to receive Cody. Um, he's heading off to South Carolina right now. He's been to South Carolina. He's been to Connecticut, Missis, no, Michigan, um, New Hampshire. You know, he's bopping all about. So, yes, go to the group. I have a Facebook page as well, but don't put any personal information in there because that's open to the public. The group is private. Uh, if you want to be a part of it and you can't afford the shipping, let me know. I will make sure you get a shipping label because I want everybody and anybody who wants to be a part of this to be a part of this. And what, what happens is... The person who has him ships him to the next person, and that person will ship him to the next person. The only time that will change is if you don't want your address to be pu pushed on to the next person. Some people are, are just like that. They don't want anybody having their address. And then I will have him ship back home to me, and I will ship him on from there. But if you don't want your address shared, you have to let me know, okay? So that is Cody. Um, definitely come be a part of it. Like my video if you think this is pretty cool. Uh, share it so that other people can find it. And maybe get to be a part of this. That would be awesome. Because I want as many people to experience what a traveler's notebook is. What a ringed planner is. If they've never seen one. Or, you know, or wanted to experience a different style. A different size. There's that. Um, subscribe and I'll pop into your, your little world. As many times as I can just to bug you. Because <laughs> why not? Right? Alright guys. I love you all. Please stay safe. Stay healthy. And be kind to one another. You know we all need it in these days. And shed some smiles. Because we all could use them. And they're contagious. Alrighty. I love y'all. I will see you in the next one. Bye now.